I'm Valentina Giambini and uh, I'm Italian and I just graduated in conservation biology. So with a first class honours and I'm very proud of it <laughs> and it's great to have a sunny day to celebrate. Um, I think what I really enjoyed about Scotland it's, uh, and Aberdeen um, and Scotland in general is the respect of people like that like towards nature and environment in general. Uh, so um, I quite like to hike as well. So actually one of my highlights was to just go in the mountains and hike and climb Munros and just uh, you know be in the wild and see with my eyes <laughs> what conservation is about in the field as well. And so yeah, Scotland has amazing mountains and uh, um, also the sport village and the sport side. Um, it's really nice and uh, well obviously the social life you know it's so <laughs> it's uh, still student life and you have some places in Aberdeen where you can kind of enjoy yourself and there's also a great international environment uh, so I met people from all over the world and uh, it's been a great experience. Yeah I think my favorite bits were well the field trips where you learn a lot and it's incredible how uh, different it is from lectures because you're out there in the field really and uh, things uh, become real and there's not just in textbooks. Um, also, probably the stats. I know it's not a popular <laughs> uh, part, but also statistics. I felt like, the, like this course really gave me the tools to actually understand what's happening out there. And although it is a bit scary and not a lot of people enjoy it, I think it's one of the bits that we'll uh, use the most also when we leave uh, Aberdeen. So the, yeah, also the skills part has been really, really well done and the staff was great in teaching um, us about yeah, computer programming as well and uh, things like that. Well, um, after well, tomorrow I'm getting a flight and I'll go to the Alps to work with a life uh, conservation uh, project about wolves in the Alps. So I'll be catching wolves for a few weeks and then yeah, monitoring their situation and spread over the Alps. Uh, so that's the, that's the have a fun for now, <laughs> getting paid, <laughs> so, um, so yeah, then I'll take a gap year and uh, do some more volunteering, uh, some work maybe, I still have to find, <laughs> and, uh, and then I'll go to study ecology, either in Sweden, maybe, or well, somewhere else, so those are the plans for now. Yeah. Uh, well, I think, well, I'm Italian, so first of all, like, mastering English. Maybe I still have an accent, probably I do, <laughs> but uh, well, that's, uh, I've improved my English. And, but besides that, obviously, it's, uh, it's also the skills that we get in, uh, well, both mastering data sets, like scientific data sets, and uh, uh, so doing like the ecological side of that, uh, but also just writing essays and reports and um, all those things that I guess it will become very useful in our uh, job life and <laughs> although it might be a bit boring while you're you know a student you're like oh yeah we have to do this essay or a rapper and you're kind of swearing <laughs> but but then it will it will be it will be very useful and uh, yeah I think it's the and also the, well all the theory behind it but also the practical side of it was what I enjoyed most and I think will, yeah, will be most useful in the later years.